Hello, Mario. In this video, I'm going to take a look at the Hamilton City Council, GIS. First things first, we go to Google, type in Hamilton City Council, and click on their main page there, intro page, taking a little look, and here it is. Now, it's not obvious exactly where to go to it, but if we go here, we can go to find it. And down there, it's called the City Waters Viewer. So really, um, this particular GIS um, just has a, a view of their utilities and their viewers. So um, obviously, here it is here. Um, some various bits and pieces here. And we just click on here, like so. And it opens up this window, hopefully, coming, coming up. And there it is. That's the um, view of the uh, city waters viewer. And um, we, if we look, take a look down here in the legend, we've got wastewater, stormwater, and water there. And that's our legend there. So now we, um, we've got, just look at the tools. We've got a print tool here, a layers tool here, which um, allows us to put on various bits of information and the 200 and, uh, 2015 aerial photography um, aerial photography there uh, under, underlying it. So um, that's always very helpful. Here we are focused on uh, Seddon Park. Um, we have a measuring capability here. Let's have a look at that. Uh, measurement results. So obviously you've got a little uh, area uh, distance, location, and what have you, full extent, um, obviously, oh, that's the whole, the whole district extent there, so you can see uh, the area covered, which is essentially the Hamilton City Council, and the clear map, uh, so that's clearing, so now let's, um, let's just, so we can obviously go to where we want to go, or we have a means of finding an address here. So uh, let's, I wonder if we go to Rotokari, which is where uh, Wintec is, or Rotokari Road, will take us over to there, and obviously push the little um, search icon here, and uh, that takes us um, over to Roto carry there, which is for some reason, uh, I'll turn that off like that, um, has labelled some various um, bits in yellow there. Um, I'm not specifically sure what that's all about, but um, we're particularly maybe interested in Wintech, um, which is where our activities are based for our surveying there. So let's um, just try and pan on down to Wintech, so um, I can't see a pan tool as to how we move around. I might just be uh, a little bit there. Um, okay, so navigating round, it's not all that particularly easy. Uh, here we have Wintech here. Oh, we can just hold down the left mouse button and move it around to pan. Now I'm particularly interested in a little area down in here um, where we've we've done a bit of surveying and things here. And here's our uh, Wintech um, G block in here where our engineering um, school is based. And uh, we can have a bit of a look around and, and see. So um, let's just zoom in on a few uh, bits and pieces. So we have a stormwater manhole in the middle here um, so I might just go to these layers and see what we can turn on so we've got wastewater labels that they can be turned on stormwater labels and they can be turned on and off obviously water labels so it's pretty much all the label oh, property labels that's property labels it's possibly quite handy uh, labels being turned on there so that's all the labels turned on, or oh, the HCC grid, I don't quite know 
what that that might relate to some earlier um, plans and things. Okay, so we've got all those turned on. So there we've got the information there. Now I'm not so sure what happens if we can click on a... Oh yes, stormwater... Oh, so we can actually click on the uh, thing. So, oh, there's stormwater manhole um, there. Um, there's some levels on that, a depth, diameter, um, when it was installed, and um, all sorts of uh, little bits and pieces like that, which is really handy. Okay, so now we we can click on uh, here, and um, we can see that we get some um, inf information actually about the water main, the diameter, the length, and the uh, pipes, and what have you. So there's quite a lot of information to be had to be had here. Um, so. Let's just click on this one here. Um, we've got um, some identification numbers. It's a, a pipe log, water main type, diameter 250 mil, uh, length in millimeters 474, uh, material. Um, so, ah, there it is there. So that's that one there. Um, some elevations, uh, length, and um, when it was installed, 1st of August 2012. So that's um, some quite handy information there. Um, we can also see down in here um, the um, land information. Uh, no information available. So we can click on a lot of these labels in uh, Section 5. Um, doesn't seem to come up. So there is some options in here to click to click in these and um, you know find out various bits of information. Um, so that's searching road carry road. Um, let's search a property here five Karen Crescent. Uh, this is a property that I'm familiar with. So I'll go in there and search that. Okay, so here it is here. All right. Yes, and there's some information there. Lot 33, so that's handy for getting your... Um, there's no, no information available there. Um, so outside we've got a 40 mil... Um, 40 mil... Uh, main there, or installed in 1979, um, it's live, 40 mil. Um, don't quite know what's going on there, whether we can get any details on that. Uh, service line connection, uh, installed 1984. Um, yep, some things in there. Also, um, so here's our stormwater, uh, sort of, sorry, uh, sanit uh, wastewater. So we can, um, got a thing there, got a level, uh, a depth, diameter, ooh, 1050, oh, of the, of the um, manhole diameter, yeah, when it was put in. So that's 1979. In there, and uh, similarly, um, we don't, oh, there's a catch pit there. Uh, catch pit there, running um, to our uh, stormwater man manhole there. So um, well, that's all um, very interesting and uh, can tell us quite a lot of uh, information about these properties and the detail there. So um, yeah, um, a simple um, GIS there for finding uh, various things in, uh, within the Hamilton City. Um, so, uh, yeah, that might be uh, quite worthwhile. Also um, shows the uh, property boundaries. Um, I'll just have a look at uh, things can be turned on and off. We can see uh, where the stormwater and sewer and what have you is. So, um, yeah, and the quite recent up-to-date photography. So that's very good. Yeah, so there we are. We've had a bit of a look at the uh, Hamilton City Council uh, GIS, a um, little bit, perhaps a little bit difficult to find in the actual website itself, but
but very good information, a lot of uh, useful information there, particularly with regards to levels and, uh, and that sort of thing, and up-to-date photography, um, you know, relatively uh, easy to find your way around it. So, yeah, all good.